Hello everyone, welcome back to the best via blog .com. Hey, stop, round table. Stop. No, stop. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey everybody, welcome back to the best via blog. Number 18. Right. What do we drink today? Let me smell your dick. So it's going on five in the morning. What you got to do? Let me smell your dick. Alright, good. Um, <laughs> round table number 18, <laughs> best beer blog. <coughs> this is Cisco Indie Pale Ale. This is Cisco Brewers out of Nantucket. Wonderful brewery. They make Wonderful good routers too. Make good what? Routers. Mm -hmm. They do. Cisco. Really? Routers. You're just gonna like go geek like that. I will fuck you with this bottle, I swear to God. I've seen him do it. You know what? Mike, look at me in my eyes. Look at the fear. I've seen him do it. It's gonna be like this, I'll and break, then you I tip me break, over. So I will it's like break glue, this glue, off. Glue, glue, glue. All right, let's make this glue. one not. Did I ever tell you about the time on. that I saw the dude drink a Corona through his eye? That's bad, dude. That should have fucked you. I up. saw a Corona, a guy, or in your butt. If you pour a beer in your butt, you'll die. Instant. Why would you die? Dead. No, that's not true. You, yes, no, it, it is. is true. It is because true. Because your liver, or kidney, or whatever that organ is, filters the alcohol. Yeah, alcohol poison. You put straight alcohol in your butt, die. Done. Want to try? I'll show you later. Don't ever put alcohol in your bottom. Disclaimer right here. We'll do another round table 19. <laughs> round table <laughs> 19. No, 20 for the butthole. Is that oh, the yeah, one where you hold it? You hold we'll call it special butthole. Hold me a pile driver. Special oh, shaking me. It'd be like a uh, like a comedy relief thing where you know like where they raise money for something. So uh, no, gener no, it's true balls. because generally in comedy reliefs they do a lot of raping with beer bottles. Yeah, they do, but it's fun. Should we start this one over? Nope. Nope. All right, let's pour it up. Mike, what is it again? Indie Pale Ale. It's an IPA. So we're go. not going to start this one off. Why not? No, why would we? I don't know. Why would we? Because we're fucking drunk. We've already had butt rape. Uh, it's smell your dick. He's drinking a gallon dick. of fucking... A gallon of Newcastle? Newcastle. He's drinking a gallon of Newcastle. They're drinking awesome homebrew. Oh, it smells good. Right off the bat, there. I get a little bit of that. It's good. It's good beer. Face. <laughs> can I read this? Yeah, yeah of course please you can. read it. trying to prove to people that you can actually <laughs> read. I've actually practiced. Speak up. Finally, <laughs> an American style IPA from us. This beautiful red orange ale has a full multi body, balanced by a fruity apricot grapefruit right? nose. Mounds of dark summer hops in the whirlpool and dry hop additions like provide hops. deliciously quenching finish to this east meets west west so? coast. That was that's why cool. did you do that? That's really bad. That was my uh. Julia Childs? Yeah, yeah I see? That's why I, so I didn't do it that bad, did I? I yeah, it. suck it. Yeah, but Julia Childs, this isn't funny. Are you gonna if you would have done the Swedish Chef, it would have been better. Drink the fucking beer. That's it downstairs. It smells delicious. Can we drink it now? Yeah, of course we can. You do whatever you want. I'm not the boss here. Joe, you stop. See, you know what? I'm gonna say it when it's my turn. Go ahead. It's not bitterer than I expected. It's an IPA. It's a weird... No. Nope. I get you. It's different. Yep, I get you. There's like a weird thing going on there. It's very it's very dry. Don't you fucking shake your head at me! Sorry, that was my... Justice. Angry. Justice. Thunder lips commands it. Justice! Justice. Something different about this. Yeah, a little bit different. Get the taste it's not bad. Can we talk about each other? Can you say something about it? It's really good. Can you say something about it? Can you say something about it? Yeah. <laughs> are you going to rant and hey, rave? Hey, this is Joe. I'm just going to drink the whole thing. Sure. Hey, Mike, Mike. Like a volcano. <laughs> it's, like, it's different. It's different. Something, so different. something different about this. There's something different. Can you elaborate, please? Something different. Mike, what do you think? <clears throat> um, let me see. It's, no, it's different. It's different on the back. Like There'll it's, be something different about it's this. It's IPA. It's IPA in the front. It's IPA in the middle. And then something happens at the end when it's like, uh, this, like something happens. Throat. I get you. I understand. Something that. happens at the end. Is that your... Is that it? No, I think that's what happens to Joey all the time. Something happens at the end. Mike, what do you think? Oh, you too. Oh, my turn? There you go. Um, I agree with Joe. It's... Oh! Really. Thank you! Such a different Thank you. No, no, no. I like it. It's um, it's that dry... That dry IPA. Like, you, know, you get those... Some of those IPAs that are just really, like, refreshing and super hoppy. This is more like the... The more bitter, dry... You know right in front dry, though. Like, dry all the way through the... The, the, the sip. You know, they, what, you know they, might, they might be right in the description. This is East meets West Coast. Yeah. You know yeah, what it is? Really good. And I'm going to elaborate on it. Is that hey, pay we're attention. seeing... Hey, everybody at home, pay fucking attention. Mike's going to elaborate. <clears throat> Mike's going to elaborate. We're seeing the breakout of the East Coast IPA. Especially the Northeast. Because we're seeing Mayflower IPA, Smutty Nose, 
watch Shoes It Now, which has the green monsters switch over the IPA. They, sure. They've all got this very dry, really kind of like, like airy, not beat you over the head. Unless you're judging, you're going on a great rant right now. Yeah, it's good to you. I brought it. It wasn't. Go ahead. <coughs> Sorry, I'm good. East Coast, West Coast IPA. Sometimes when you talk, it just fucking melts my face. Like it is, oh, it is the most amazing. When you s- fucking spit out that fucking beer knowledge you have, keep talking. I just want to, I want to fuck your keep voice. Talking. I want to fuck your ear. If your voice came out, I would be right there. I want to hear more. I want to hear more. When the air comes out, I want to. I just want to. I want to fuck your hot air voice. Spider Man. Spider Man. I want to gobble up your 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 beer knowledge voice and all of you. I like this. That's what you see in them. I think you're getting a lot of the. Um, I think the Northeast is is identifying itself with with a good IPA, whereas the, the West Coast has had the IPA on lockdown for so is long. Is this West Coast? This, this no, this is place? very East Coast. This is, this is very, 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 very East. Coast. The West Coast is more of like East the, like the race of fire. Beat you over the head. Yeah. Like yeah real really hot hobby. bombs. Real, real citrusy, like crazy grapefruit flavors. That's this. That's, this, that's, that's, that's like East. I mean, West Coast. That's West Coast. Yeah. This is more dry. dry it's okay. a little understated. A little more balanced, but <clears> still. Still very flavorful, and I yeah. think that that's great. I think all the, the especially the northeast of the stuff that we drink, anyways. You know, we drink a lot of Mayflower IPA, some smutty, you know, smutty nose. But the Mayflower is that hoppy like West Coast style. But right? no, it's not. not Mayflower is very, very East Coast. Is it really? Very East Coast, yeah. I think it's very different from this, though. It is different. Really different. Different, ideas. different but same. I mean, I mean, we're talking, we're speaking like we're speaking, get, we're speaking in nuance. At this I get point, the back know? end of we're the, of the hairs, IPA, like know? the front end of the IPA and the Mayflower is. And okay, now, yeah. a Mayflower IPA does not taste like a Green Flash. No, or a Race of Fire. No, okay, no, no, no. so so that's so that's East West distinction. I get you. Okay, yeah. now this, this and a Mayflower are close. East West. Let's say so, like they said on the label. I don't like it though. I don't like that. I think it's you East. Don't like it? I think it's you East. Think no, I, I like it. I think it's delicious. Oh. I think I don't like the description. I think it's East. You like East. this? Is this? Is, this I think is I think it's, it's identifiable as being East Coast. I think it's fucking delicious. I think it's very well balanced. You're saying it's not? I'm not taking pieces or nuances from the West Coast. I this think we're finally, fi- we're finally this finding an it. identity with, 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 with so East Coast. So somebody in the West Coast drinks yeah. this, are going to go, that's an East Coast. Because yeah. I, I mean, even if you drink something like a Dogfish 60, there's still a lot of West Coast influence in that. You know, right. But I mean, it's been around for a long time, it's, so it's, you know, it's to be expected. Just, yeah. but, so would you say this is more of an East Coast IPA or a West Coast IPA? You're, you're just going to be like that. You're just going to be a dick. Just to be a dick. No, I mean, I see what you're no, saying. I get it. No, you don't. I see what you're saying because it's Sorry. Easty. It's kind of Eastish. But to distinguish. But it's also kind of Eastish. Tell me more. Yeah. Tell me more about what you think. To distinguish, this is if somebody in, in California would drink this, all right, this is an East Coast IPA flavor. It's good. This is I like it. Is. I'm happy about that. I'm, I'm, I'm saying that like this is yeah. it's a good thing. I liked for me like this is a good beer. I like it a lot. What do you yeah, think? I drink it, but I like that West Coast. Of course, oh, yeah. There's, there's nothing to that. say. You you like you're not supposed to like that. I do too. I mean, no, I prefer, I prefer it over this. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, give me the both. I'm going to take that one better, only because the for me the dryness sometimes just kind of. You don't like that? It dulls it down for me, yeah. I think I think I think these kind of IPAs go better with, with, with a lot of food pairing, so better than I the think West Coast? I think a West Coast IPA is just Depends on a the lot food. of time it's like it's the beer. The beer just you're stands alone. That's, you, that's, like, that's, that's, that's it's like the main event. You know? food, yeah, this yeah, is something you just it's no, very, I can see that. I can see very, that. Very yeah. very delicious. But I like the uh, I like those beers better, I think. Than these right now. But that doesn't mean my the more I drink the the East Coast might get better. We can we can talk all day. You got like Founder Centennial, which is probably my favorite IPA. Oh, the planet. That's a good one. It's amazing. Yeah. But, you know, they have freaking Michigan, so what does that say? You know, they're fucking not quite in the middle of the country, uh, but close. I'm trying right. to see the ABV on anyway, this. I'm going to give this one a, um, probably a B+. Plus. Plus. Don't say B+. Plus. Motherfucker. You can say B+, plus too. It's fine if you have the same thing. I'm going first from now on. Uh, Joe, you go first. You went first. I'm going to say this is B+. Plus. I don't like <laughs> the fact that you've got panties <laughs> in the bunch right now. <laughs> All right, Mike, go ahead. Um, I'll give it an A. I'm gonna go with a solid A. I'm gonna give it a. Um, you said B plus already. I'm gonna give it a B. Can I change mine? <laughs> B plus for me. No, it's, it's good. It's, it's great, actually a really good beer. It's great beer. I like it. E, what do you think? I'm gonna go A minus. I like that. Yeah. Um, it's good. It's very drinkable, isn't it? Very drinkable. It, yeah. I don't know if it's an East meets West, but I think it is uh, an IPA session beer. Yeah. I can't drink, find an ABV on it though. Can you? Can you? Drink no, there's nothing on the We'll find it. Put it. No, in. you think you can. You think yeah. you can until you realize there's seven percent. You've had yeah. seventeen. The Mayflow IPAs. I, can, I love them. I can drink the shit out of them. Yeah, well, yeah. the seven percent. I mean, they're big. I, that's a I that's a pretty big idea. This, I think the difference between this and the Mayflower 
the Mayflower is hoppy taste lasts a tiny bit longer. Yeah. I like I like this. This is there's a good malt flavor no. that comes in on the back end of this. That's stuff. what it is. Especially it's it, it, not as dry. when it warms up a little bit, you I mean, pour it in the glass. This is dry though. This is dry. Very dry. But I like yeah. that though. I like okay. I like I that like I can dry. identify an East Coast IPA at this point. I like the dry. All right. You well, know? got to be plus. Hold on, uh, plus uh, uh, this is a uh, seven point five eight. eight. Is it really? It's almost eight. Yeah. Wow. For not almost no eight, but though. seven and a half. I get no booze. No, it's definitely not booze. No booze at all. Yeah, for seven you, you gotta, that's why I like the IP. You have to crest eight percent to get that. No, but you get some of the like the porters and stuff like that the, that are in the eight range that do taste boozy. With the IPAs, you hardly ever taste like that boozy. Yeah, but it's the hops. Yeah, yeah, until you get to the IPA, it's like the Maharajas, well, yeah, yeah. The, uh, the, uh, the Great Divides, the, the Hercules, you know, some of the like the nine, the eight, eight and a half to ten and a half. Yeah. So you're like, okay, well, eight and a half, ten and a half. Yeah, but I mean, eight's... Some once boozy. once my pants come off, I'm like, yeah, we know he's been drinking eight. Hi yeah. right, guys, sounds good. Thank you very much. Another one in the can. See you later. Take it easy. Peace out.